Okay, I suppose. Oh my gosh, does this thing still actually have the protective label on it? Now I feel kind of bad for ripping that off. But wow. I didn't think that it still had actually had the protective label on it. Anyway, it's actually gone to sleep, but um, there's the scanner mechanism. This is an Epson, Epson Perfection 1250 Epson. <laughs> Um, it's a color scanner, obviously. I believe it's a 1200 dpi? Maybe it's 2400 dpi, I don't know. Um, but on the back, you can see we have the USB. We have, I, I don't know what that is. Maybe that's Apple cereal, I'm not sure. Although I can't understand why this thing would have Apple cereal. I think it's too new for that power connector and it also has the lock so if you were to unplug it and uh, slide that across it would work that way. I'm going to attempt to get a scan in here. I don't know if it's going to... Oh yeah, there it does. So uh, it actually brings up the uh, the scan thing. Let's see it start. The light will flash when it goes off. That's a little scan light. Still works perfectly. I mean, there's absolutely no problems whatsoever. See it going absolutely crazy. Now there are some blemishes that I should probably clean off, but um, other than that, oh, you actually kind of saw the ref see my reflection in there, so I should be careful what I do. Um, yeah. Yep. There it goes. And it's now scanning. Yeah, but I think maybe my lens is going to need to be cleaned. You can see the big mechanism behind it, too. Let's see it turning. Albeit rather slowly. It turns back a lot faster that way. And that's the way the scanner works. So let's take a look at what kind of a monster we created. Yeah, it's kind of dark. But you can't really see anything, and for good reason. Kept moving the camera. Uh, but that's the way it works. You can see it can accept up to letter size. Both way, actually. A4 max lengthwise, and a letter size length, max lengthwise, widthwise. Uh, there's a little ribbon cable. Then it connects to the data circuitry at the back of the uh, the unit. It's a really nice, really nice piece of equipment. You could probably uh, disassemble it somehow, but uh, I don't really feel like doing that. You can see the plate and cover here. Really nice condition. Probably could uh, stand to be glued back on, but other than that, it's perfect.